hey guys, it's me and I went and I'm talking about the PS5 event. I just figure I'm going to give some predictions on what I think is going to be shown and what's not going to be shown. Just three predictions here. Number three, let's start off with something pretty simple. I believe they're mostly going to show their first party games. They're not going to be like Xbox, I believe, because Microsoft, I think in a lot of their presentation, they do show a good amount of third party games. I feel like the PS5 event will show mostly first party. This is Sony. They got plenty first party they could show. Now, for some reason, I really think Killzone may be something that they're going to reveal at the event. I, I think that may be a launch game. I haven't heard much about Killzone lately, but I think Killzone 5 probably could be a launch game on the PS5. And I don't think there's going to be any Uncharted 5 announced at this event. If it is, maybe just a little teaser at the end. I don't think they're going to focus on that because I don't think that's going to be a launch game. I think that's going to be a game, if it comes out, that's going to come out like maybe one or two or even three years into the PS5's lifespan. I just don't think they're going to open the gate with that. Number two, there will be lots of gameplay. Why? Because I think the PlayStation learns from Microsoft when Microsoft had all those weird rules for like lending your games out and or whatnot. And Sony came back with this video they made about how to lend your games, just like, hey, you hand him the game. And similarly, I think they were watching Xbox Series event and they probably saw the aftermath that some people, because there was some gameplay at the event, but I think people wanted more gameplay. So they probably saw the aftermath of people like saying, hey, we wanted more gameplay at the event. So they're probably going to make sure that there's a lot of actual gameplay in this PS5 event if it happens. And number one, I really think they will not show the price because I really think Sony is playing the waiting game. They're waiting to see what the Xbox Series X will be before they actually reveal their price so they could match it or maybe do lower than it. I'm not going to say they're necessarily going to undercut Microsoft in price, but I do think that they're going to be watching Microsoft and wait until they reveal the price so they could either make sure that they're the same price or lower. Anyway, those are my three predictions. What do you guys think will be at this PS5 event? Let me know in the comments below. Thanks for watching, like, and subscribe. May God bless you all.